So you got this sister that's, you know, starting to realize what we talked about in the just hilarious video. If you have seen that video, um, that they are responsible for what's going on right now with the trans women, but let's review it. So yesterday on TikTok, I went viral for my just hilarious accuse of being transphobic. And I got a couple of DMs from men saying, do you feel like black women are the reason of why uh, black transgender women feel like they can disrespect y'all? And I had to sit back and think like, yeah, we are the, re when I say we, not me or you uh, in particular, but just as a collective, we have given them a light to say, oh yes, you can disrespect our black men. You can sit here and say, oh, they're misogynistic, they blah, 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 blah. But then I felt like, and I'm just assuming that a lot of transgender women want to really feel like they are natural born women and really feel like they can replace us. Now it's, well, black women, you don't gatekeep uh, periods and you don't gatekeep this and we're we're more woman uh, than you. I even heard uh, we taught you how to be women, and it's like, okay, what the hell is this coming from? And but you see how it started. You admitted it was okay to use the trans women to talk down and denigrate black men, and that was fine to you in the midst of you teaching them how to be a woman. That was fine, but now it's turned on his head, and now you're not liking it. See. Stop, stop doing evil things against a black man. Stop. It's always going to turn back on you. You're supposed to be with your man, not against him. And so I feel like we didn't let them in our spaces instead of letting them have their own space as being transgender women. Since this conversation is getting so ridiculous, black women, we pretty much are forced to stand up for ourselves and don't let them. And I'm not saying this is all transgenders, but don't let them feel like you're transphobic just for simply standing up for yourself. Well, I mean, what you mean their own spaces? They, their spaces is your spaces because you invited them into those spaces. You didn't tell them from the beginning, you know, hey, I respect you, but y'all need to go create your own lane. Go do that somewhere else, not over here. So no, there's, so the reason why they tell you you're transphobic by telling them they need their own spaces is because you, all of a sudden now you're rejecting them. All of a sudden now you're discriminating against them. All before it was all good, right? It was all good. Y'all were girlfriends. You see, you see, you see what happens when you don't listen to your man about, about a whole lot of things. Cause the black man told y'all, but you don't want to listen to the black man. So now this trans woman problem is an issue for you. It's not an issue for brothers. We've been telling y'all about that issue. Been telling y'all is still telling y'all about that issue. And some of y'all will still embrace them and hang out with them and teach them and, everything. But now it's getting, now it's getting out of hand. And, and now y'all want to say something. Like I said, don't get mad. Now y'all created that issue. You got to deal with that. But next time, listen to your, your black man when he's talking to you, because black men are trying to protect you. There's no other group of men that's trying to look out for you, but the black man, white men, not looking out for you They're as a collective, they're not Hispanics, Asians, Arabs, Native Americans, no other group of people is looking out for you except the black man. And that just, that just on God on that one. When we talking to you, even if you disagree sometime, think about what we're telling you. Think about what's right and wrong. And you wouldn't be having these issues, but they all let me know what y'all think about what she's saying. Because like I said, I'm shaking my head about this. Cause y'all, it, it's not, it, not only y'all have issues with just the brothers, on certain issues, issues with marriage. Now y'all got to deal with the trans woman issue. That's a lot to deal with sister.